Hi, I'm Ian Jackson and I'm part of the My Year group. I'm one of the teachers this year and I just want to introduce myself and tell you a little bit about myself. So I've been an artist most of my life. I've been drawing and painting since childhood. I took it seriously uh, when I went on to college and did sign writing and various other creative courses and things like that and including printmaking and printing so I've got a lot of traditional things that I do like doing I'm also very much into uh, what you would call modern digital art it, there's all sorts of things that I like to do with that and hopefully throughout the year you'll see a combination of both of those uh, techniques being shown through some of the videos that I will be doing. I'm also open to do videos on how to do what would, what is called plein air painting or going outdoors and painting with uh, or drawing uh, the outdoor. So what I've planned is a brand new watercolour set that I've put together and I'll be explaining that as well how I've actually put this watercolour set together uh, from different individual companies rather than getting a set of paints so I'm not a person that does goals as such I'm more a person who aspires to particular situations so I'm open to branch out as much as I possibly can creatively get to know you as people and enjoy my art really because that really is what the important point is enjoying your art one of the things that we are concentrating on is budget friendly it's not cheap to be able to put artwork together these days and it gets more and more expensive so we'll try and focus as well on how to control our budgets and how to get the most out of the equipment that we have or if we are purchasing new equipment is it any good? Well, we'll have a look at reviewing a few things and see whether they do what they say they do and add the value for money. Although I don't do scrapbooking or journaling and things like that, I'm quite interested in having a look at that. But mainly my art that I do is is watercolours and uh, pencil sketching but I, I want to be able to expand that kind of artwork into possibly uh, some form of journaling if possible. I've done a bit of uh, book binding in, in the past so I am familiar with putting books together so that'll be an interesting thing to see if I can have a look at. One thing I want to have a look at this year and and get a lot better at is colour pencil work uh, at a reasonably high detail level because I do really like that kind of stuff but I've never really been able to fully uh, produce the artwork for the amount of time that you spend at a reasonably good quality so that's that's something I'm definitely wanting to improve in my artwork for me I want to also try to see how I can take my art and use it so that I'm paying for that art uh, through uh, 
selling my art. It might be something that some of you are ready to do. So hopefully we can pass on good information with one another and show where good places to sell our art is. Because uh, as I've said, it can be very expensive producing art. So we at least need to want to make it so that it's self-sufficient. With regards to old things, I have a video that's a slideshow showing what I did last year with this group and uh, that might give you an idea of the kind of paintings and drawings that I do. I'll encourage you to go and have a look at that as well as part of the old last year thing. Those of you who were part of last year's group can still go and look at all of the group's uh, activities and you can also find me uh, by looking up IA Jacks, that's an X, 71 but I'll put some information in the info box below the video and uh, you can look up that. So I hope this has been uh, a nice introduction and uh, you've got to know me a little bit better. I really encourage you to go and put up your artwork on the group site and uh, we'll all encourage one another. So thanks for spending a little bit of time with us and uh, we'll see you later.